but all the, the people out there wanting to become pilots and so on, what would your key bits of advice be for them? Um, study hard in school. I was average at school, very average. So I went and found the smartest guy in school and I asked him how long he was going to study for for his exam on Friday. He said 20 minutes. So I studied 20 minutes. I know I got a D, I got 46%. So that made me really mad. So I went back and I studied for four hours and I got 96% and I topped the class. And then from that day on, I worked out it wasn't how brainy I was, it was how hard I was for people to try. I'm all about education because I think it makes you a braver, more worldly person. These days I do think you need to have an education. I definitely think it's worth having training for. And then you'd say, so where's your business plan? I studied marketing and a bit about business planning. When you come to decide who you employ and you get hundreds of applicants, mm -hmm. um, it gets very difficult to uh, separate people out other than on their career at the university. Make sure they continue down the education uh, stream or the workforce stream because not everyone makes it anyway. So uh, that's another big mistake. They put all their eggs in one basket and. You know, we all change how we think and feel about things as we go along. Mm. It makes sense to, to pursue uh, tertiary education. I went to university. I never wanted to leave, so I did three degrees. So actually, the employment side is something I got from my university background. So I would have found it really, really hard to know what the hell to do. The way I differentiate myself from other chefs is, yeah, I've got that very strong science background, so I can combine the art of cooking with the strong science. Of, um, yeah. So I've been a, um, an ACA, Associate Chartered Accountant, uh, over that time, and, and you know it's just been a, a really uh, good thing to know you've got you've got some fallback position if, if you ever need it. My yep. best friends now are actually not people I went to school with; it's people I went to university with.